guys and welcome to another mad chilly video. I hope uh, it's actually a bit of a different video really. I hope the audio today is actually uh, alright on this camera. I haven't done a bit of recording on it for quite some time now. Um, but I, I figured today I want to do a bit of a different video. I wanted to show you guys my wonderful little joystick. So this is the Thrustmaster USB joystick. It's quite old now, I believe. Uh, and I got it on Amazon just a few days ago, brand new, um, for just £28, believe it or not. Uh, and I basically wanted to show you guys, I was expecting something quite rubbish for £28, uh, if I'm honest. I just wanted something that was better than an Xbox controller, uh, which it certainly is, but I actually found out it was very good. So uh, first of all, it, it moves pretty good. Now I have to try and remember how to, how, how to work this camera now. If I'm honest, I have not used it for ages. Uh, but you can see that it's quite a nice little camera. Left, right, I mean, it's pretty good, really. I mean, again, unfortunately, the, the uh, it does occasionally fall off, fall over. Look, if I grip all the way to the right, it, it actually falls over slightly, so... And the same forward, backwards. It's, it's maybe not the, great, the greatest weighted. Um, but it's pretty good, really. You've got a little throttle axis down here. It's quite small, but it's pretty good, really. Um... And you've got a little button here that you can move around. That's why I use my rudder at the moment. There's the brake reverses. I'm using that as at the moment. There's a little button uh, back here that's quite hard to see, really. Just press it. And there's also a little trigger on the back, which can be used. Um, I'm using it for push-to-talk on that sim, but can also be used um, for... Uh, well, it's, re it's actually marketed as a machine gun sort of trigger, like if you're playing a game such as War Thunder or World of Warplanes or whatever. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool, really. It's uh, very nice. I quite like it, really. Um, especially for £28, it's uh, certainly very, very good. I'm very impressed with what I got for the money, I have to say. Um, which is why I decided to make a video, really. I wouldn't have typically done a unboxing video kind of thing. This is a kind of a review. Um, yeah, it's not typically what I do, but I definitely quite like it. I mean, really, if you, when, you, when you say as well that the current T1000M is £140 and the upcoming Airbus joystick for Thrustmaster is £150, this for 28 is, uh, oh, amazing. Uh, it's pretty good. So apart from the lack of, slight lack of buttons and it occasionally falling over, <laughs> it's pretty good really. I mean, all the flights and videos you've seen after the Training Academy have all been recorded on this, um, using this, and it is, it's very good. Uh, I've been using it for the bush flying and it is uh, absolutely excellent. By the way, this uh, I think this video will actually be uploaded before the bush flying goes live, so uh, kind of a little preview for that series. But I hope you guys did really enjoy watching this video, and I hope you found this useful if you're looking to buy a joystick. Bye-bye!